and then I'll we'll flip it to you. Okay. All right. All right, so I am currently at the Wola Festival, the Wola Fest here in um, Alliance Francaise, where um, there's artists whose work is being featured, they're selling their work, there's a lot of talent here, and I wanted to show you some of this work and talk to some of these artists to tell you a little bit about their work. Um, there's just some beautiful pieces here, and it was so important for me to be able to talk to these artists and share their stories with you. Um, so I'm hoping that some of you will join this live stream soon. Um, but uh, yeah, these artists are really, 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 really good. I'm not seeing anybody join. Am I on public or am I on unlisted? All right. Because sometimes I do these live streams and I don't realize that it's unlisted, but I see that there's people joining the live stream now. So I'm going to repeat again. I am here at Wola Festival. There's a lot of artists here who are featuring their work. And there's a, a lot of talent here in Ghana. And there's so much creativity and so much skill, so much capabilities. And they're also selling their artwork. So they'll give their social media information. And if you're interested in buying, um, I'll even put some of the links into the description of this video so that you can click the link and get to their pages and find out how you can buy it. So the first artist I'm going to talk to, his work is right in front of me here. Let me flip the screen so you can see his artwork there and this is the artist yeah. I'm gonna put the mic on you so that because the music is loud so I want to make sure that you're heard so I'll clip this on you and so um, so yeah so tell us who you are your social media handle and um, and then talk about your artwork okay um, I'm Senatius Alexander um, I'm a product of Ganata College of Art and Design. I have a diploma in art. And on my social platform, Senatius, Senatius, almost all the platforms you can follow, all the platforms, their social handles, Senatius. Spell it for those who don't know how to spell Sena, it. Sena is S E A S E N A T U S E. Senatius. Okay, Senatius. Right. This piece behind you is beautiful. Talk about this. Well, this, this piece here uh, talks about uh, the wonderful boy in Africa, you know, in the farmland, you know, but this represents uh, sweetness. That's how I see it, sweetness, the, uh, the, the, the sunflower, uh -huh. so sweetness. And as, as well, you can see the bear too. The bear too is, uh, I was inspired by this picture. Initially, the, the main picture wasn't like this but uh, I try to create around the picture by bringing the sunflower. Initially, the main picture was a, 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 a balloon, yeah. but a balloon without the bird. But looking at the picture, I was kind of like, no, let me be creative around this picture. So I intended to create something like a, a sunflower with the bird, you know, that should tell you that uh, we eat and best to eat, you know. Yeah, yeah. So this tells you that this boy is a wonderful boy from the farmland, you know, which tells you how rich our culture and our system works here, you know. Yeah, that is why I, I, I was inspired by this particular picture and I painted it this way and moreover you can see a newsprint on it oh I didn't even notice that before newspapers yes a newsprint on it which shows which tells you a collage it's, it's, a, it's a collage you know we call it collage and uh, you can see some of the written in it which engage you the clients to read through it and get interrupted with the work that is the idea and the concept behind this work you know so it's not that um, I'm just painting any work you no know, but there's a reason and the concept behind it so I call this work a wonderful boy you know yeah okay and then you have this one is yours also yes this one too is mine and this one is the fluid man you know uh, uh, the title of this one is awakening of the flute you know okay. which tells you this man whenever he he kind of like um used the flute tells you a story about uh humans and our ancestors you know it's, it's, it's a way of communication to our ancestors you know and this is how this man communicates with our ancestors you know in our culture in a uh, traditional way you know so i painted this 
through a man in our village who does this whenever the chief or the king there wants him to give a message to the uh, community so he has a way of doing this by um, using the flutes you know so that alone inspired me to paint him as well too so this is another work of mine and um, no and this one too yeah and this Ooh, one too that. i can see the emotion in her face yes yes wow this one this one too tells a story about what my mother has been through raising me as a child you know when my help the title of this work is help 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 means um you know we, we normally find this kind of stuff in a, a culture or in a in a traditional uh diaspora you yeah. know let me put it this way you know whereby uh, a single mother who needs her help from a family member or a relative or something but there's no help yeah so it kind of like keep that kind of pain silence within herself yeah you know and moreover me being an artist growing up i saw those pain and the ghost grief in my mother's eyes so seeing this picture inspired me to depict that and to tell a story about what I have been through as a single uh, parent you know as in my mother being a single parent and raising me you know because at the point in time she was tired so she couldn't raise me she has to give me to people I stayed with people before I got to where I am you know so I know how it feels to be a single mother so uh, this work is more or less like a voice to single every single mother out there who is going through a lot you know yes so yeah, this you, see the, you really see the emotion in her face yes like, yes the pain in the eyes and yes yes you really did a good job capturing this. yeah yeah and moreover too this also tells a story about um uh my father let me put it this way this is about your father yeah my father of course i said uh, within me within me it's the regrets he has he had he, he didn't know that I will, I, will, I will grow up to be this great artist but as growing up he kind of like felt oh I could have I, I could have I could have helped my son to become what he wanted to be but he didn't do that so seeing this picture also inspired me and I'm like no it's a communication between my father and me yeah you know which I really want to put it in a in, in, in a in a in a artistic form yeah. you know to paint it to show because you can look into his eyes, he tells you, it connects you to his soul. You know, tells you within me, he has so many pain, he has so many regrets, you know. And moreover, we have a lot of people, a lot of men in our society who grew up with a lot of pain and regrets because they didn't take care of their family. You know, and we can we can normally find this kind of works, we can normally find this kind of things in our in in, in our in our in our in our community or in our uh that's inspired me to paint you know and I worked on and I really enjoy working on this kind of works or this kind of piece because it's a story that tells about Senna Chiefs. Okay so how much is this piece? Uh, this piece is because of the promo initially the, this piece is 2000 Ghana City but because of the promo we are giving it for 800 Ghana City. That's just if you're at the event? Yes. So for those people who are watching right now they're not here right now. Yes. So this would be 2000 Ghana Yeah City. this is 2000 Ghana City. Okay. Yeah 2000 Ghana City. ship worldwide if someone wants to order something? Exactly I ship worldwide. Okay. Even when you go to DHL and you mention my name Senna they right. know me. Great. So this is 2000 Ghana Cities. Yes. And this is how much? This is 1000 Ghana City. 1005. 1500 Ghana yeah. Okay. Yes. Right. yes. Okay. Thank you. And repeat your name again because we're going to move on to another artist. Okay. My name is Senatius. I'm on all the social platforms. You can follow me. Uh, you can you can send me message. You can give me. You can commission me. You can anything. I'm ready to deliver. I'm that artist who is ready to deliver. You know. So don't hesitate to communicate or contact me for any job. Because I have people too I work with as a team. If it's a contract, I have a lot of artists probably we can work together. So trust me, please keep supporting me and keep following me. 
this is me send out to you blessings beyond measure to you all thank you thank you thank you so much yeah thank you so much you're welcome all right so this is this is this so that was artist. that was yes. one artist yeah yeah we'll, artist. we'll we'll come to you okay i promised i would talk to right, this artist right, down great. here right. and then i'll come oh, back that's to good, you that's good, that's good. Um, but we're gonna go around and talk to these artists um get information but yeah i'm coming i'm coming back so so I'm going to continue walking around and uh, looking at this work here. There's a piece of art here that I wanted to show you all that is really, really um, thought provoking. When I saw it, immediately I was like, this is an image that has a story and needs to be told. So, um, but it looks like the artist is talking to someone right now. So I may, I may have to come back. I may have to come back. Um, but the piece is really, really fascinating. And um, yeah, let me just uh, go around and show you some of the other artwork here while I'm waiting for him with the uh, person that he's talking to right now. Excuse my finger, I'm using my phone here. Yeah, so I'll, yeah, I'll take you to that. So I'll come to you okay. and uh, go back to the other artists afterwards. Okay. So I have this um, artist here. If you could share your name. Uh, uh, my, my name is Joseph Adipleku. But the signature of my painting is Joe Black. Okay. And so your social media handle? Uh, uh, artist Joe Black. Can you spell it? So A R T S I. Sorry, let me go again. A R T I S T. J O B L E K. Okay. That is my name on okay. All right. Instagram. So this is your work here. Your work seems to capture eyes. Like Sorry. The eyes. Sure. Right? Sure. Sure. So can you sure. talk about your style here and what inspires you? And okay, what uh, inspires my painting is that this work here, for instance, talk about a little girl, and the title is Child Education. Mm -hmm. And it, it depicts, I mean, we say that education is the key and i say it's one of the key so i believe that every child needs to get the opportunity to be educated every child has to be given the basics in education because children have a lot of talent and potential in them so if you don't educate them at times when they grow up they struggle in society they struggle a lot so i believe that in every stage of their life we need to give them that opportunity to assess education do you understand me uh-huh so that is what this painting depicts okay. and when it when comes to uh this as well i kind of sometimes ad advocate for women i speak for women a lot and everything about women i respect it and i love to paint women a lot women inspires me and the reason why women inspires me is that women play a major role in our society whether you you believe it or not women play major role in our society and i love how women are uh, are me are now in the front role in our society they are doing a lot they are doing great works in our society and i love that and my my mother see me being an artist especially i'm talking about this work what it depicts my mother seen me being an artist because when i was growing she encouraged me a lot i mean when she sees me draw she becomes happy she becomes excited and she goes like wow that's my son drawing and she begins to call people to come and have a look at what i'm doing so i try to paint this to tell a story also about my mom the excitement and the, and the joy she, she's of this work is a joyful mood okay. and i always want to see my mother being in that mood because i always want to be make my mother proud i also want to make her happy so that's why i painted this painting as well 
I do, but for some time now, I've, 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 hold, I've hold it on. Okay. Yeah, because of one or two things, so I've, I've hold that on now. So you're not shipping outside I'm of not, I'm not, I, I, will, I will do, I will do, I do, but I will do. But because of the COVID-19, mm -hmm. so I've, I've hold it on for now. Okay. Yeah, I've hold it for now. But if anyone wants to buy my painting and for me to shape it, I'll do so. Why not? I'll yeah, do okay. it. Yeah. All right, so you yeah. will ship if somebody wants to I, I will, I will, okay. I will. All right. I will. Okay, you gave me your card. Yeah, I gave you my card. So I have your contact. I'll sure. put your contact in the description. All right, the all right. That's so great. That's great. That's great. That's great. That's great. That's great. That's great. And, um, That's great. Continue. Okay, bye-bye. Showing the rest of this artwork here. Yeah, I have my way the earpiece. I'm here. I forgot to take the microphone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Yes. I saw you were with a you were with a potential customer, so I left. Yeah, yeah. So I left and and came back. So um, all right. This piece of artwork here. Let me put this on you here. I'm gonna pin it on you so that um. There we go. All right, so this is the piece of artwork that I wanted to talk about because when I saw it, do you mind stepping back? Your shadow is on it a little bit. Yes. So this piece of artwork, what I notice is the white hand, the black hand, the world, and the hands over the face. So if you can describe that to the audience, please do. Tell us about this piece. All right, um, this piece, this piece is called racism. We, there's too much racism in the world. White loving blacks and blacks loving white. White not loving blacks. White people treat black people bad. I'm not saying all whites are bad. We have good white people, but bad white people treat black people very, very, very bad. Now, the black hand is is on the eye like that's like the, is like opening the eye to see, and then the white hand has cover the eye for those people not to see, for the blacks not to see anything at all. But there is, there is a lot to tell. These are the racism countries. To, to pretend as if they love us, but then um, they don't. Okay, so you're saying they wear the gold jewelry? Yeah, to pretend as if they love us. The gold they stole from us. The gold they stole from, from us. From black people. And how much is this piece selling for? <laughs> or is it not for sale? It, no, it is. It is for sale. It is for sale. How much it is, is this piece selling for? This this work is selling for fifty thousand. Fifty thousand Ghana cities. Yes, please. That's about ten thousand US dollars for this piece. Um, do you ship worldwide if someone wants to order this? Yes. Okay. So if somebody yes. wants to order this piece. He does order. He does ship worldwide. Um, please give us your social media handle. My social media handle. I'm I'm called Def Art on Instagram, as a um, D E F F A R T G H. But my full name is Kinsley Kofi Defo. I'm from the Vota region. My African name is Plola. It means a leader, a shepherd. Great. And then all your all your work, what inspires you in general? Because you have this, which is very like this one is very realistic with the baby. Yeah, this. You have this was just very like you know in, it's very um, symbolic. And then we have this here. This which is this very this is called good friends. Mm -hmm. You can see a lot of eyes and nose and smiling faces and beautiful colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This 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 is called I I, I call this my life. Because when I was a child, I used to see things like this in my head. Mm -hmm. I, I can't solve stuff like this, like math, science. I don't, I'm not that person too much. Mm -hmm. So as you can see, I have 10 down, number two, two plus four is equal to, I have 10 them upside down. I used to see things like this when I was a child, but so not that's now. that's dyslexic. Yeah. I think that's dyslexic. Yeah. Until you see things differently. Yeah. When I was a child. So when you were a child, you saw things Yeah. Yeah, but when, when it comes to art, when I was a child, when it comes to art, I'm all around. I'm always there. I'm always drawing. I'm always painting. I get beaten all the time by drawing. <laughs> okay, thank you for sharing You're uh, welcome. about your artwork. You're welcome. Thank you so much. You're welcome.
thank you to so much for oh, coming to me. Oh, no problem, no problem. I just, I love to show my, my work. My are on my handles, my Instagram handles. Perfect, I'll share your Instagram um, on, uh, on the description of the video. Okay. For those of you who don't know, I often put things in the description of the video, but people always don't read it, and then they ask me the same questions in the comments, but when the video is done, when I get a chance, I'll put all of the information in the description, and then you can uh, check it out yourself. I'm pin the mic to myself. <laughs> I'm like, uh... okay, let me just hold it. <laughs> I was saying that um, I'll put everything in the description of the video. I apologize if there's some feedback because I was holding I was holding the mic in my hand and I forgot. So there's a lot of artwork here at the um, Walla Fest. Walla Fest is here in um, Accra, and it is at the Alliance Francaise. Um, this has been happening um, throughout the afternoon. Unfortunately, I got here late because I had a funeral today that I had to go to before coming here. So. Let me just quickly pan through some of this artwork so you can see some of this beautiful artwork here in Ghana um, that these artists are, are, are creating. There's so much here um, that people are doing. Artists hustling uh, to get their stuff shown, and get people to, you know, I love this one back here. This is beautiful. This one here is beautiful. Are you the artist? But you're the artist. This is beautiful. The style looks like pointillism. Yes, it's pointillism. I like it. Thank you very much. I know it's getting dark now, so the lights are kind of, um, it's hard to see the work. Um, oh, this is, this is nice. Okay, so all of your stuff is like, you all, you do pointillism for all of it. Yeah, I do pointillism. Okay. How long have you been painting? Uh, five years. Let me flip it to you. I'm trying to flip it to you. <laughs> five years. Yeah. I'm going to go up to the top there and talk to some people there. So you've been painting for five years. Tell yeah. us about um, what inspired you to get started. Yeah. Actually, um, I was born with art. We were painting in school, school days, and I love oh, drawing nice. art. So you have I've, to speak up because there's a lot of loud music. I may not yeah. hear you in the video. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I started painting, like drawing when I was in school. Okay. So after school, I decided to do something for myself. And I realized that I have a talent. So I decided to put it at use. So I studied from a lot of people, maybe try to paint from others just to pick one or two things together. So since then I realized that I have the potential. So I decided to go into pointillism and I love pointillism a lot. I quite remember when I was in school, we used to paint and they would ask us to paint and I would use the dots to make sure that I used the door to paint, so that's what encouraged me after school. Then I started the painting from there. Yeah. You're very talented. Thank you very yeah, much. Yeah, you're very talented. Like, I know the, the sun has set, but it's yeah. like you can see the details. Yeah. The details in the work. You know? Yeah. Are you from Accra? Yeah, I'm. Family is from Appa East region, Sandema, to be precise. Okay. But, okay. So. Are you, are you on social media that people want to get your work? Yeah, I'm on social media. Kweku underscore Yaro. Kweku underscore Yaro. So spell that for people who don't know how to spell it so they can find your page properly. Yeah, Kweku is K-W-A-K-U underscore Y-A-R-O. Yaro. And that's Instagram? Yeah, that's Instagram. All right. So if somebody wants to order your work, you ship worldwide if somebody orders it? Yes, I do. Uh, You'll ship worldwide? Yeah, I do. Uh, okay, yeah. great. Yeah. And so this piece here, how much is this? Um, do you remember how much this is? Yeah, 3,000. 3,000 Ghana City? 3,000 Ghana City. And this one here? Yeah, 5,000 Ghana City. This one's 5,000 Ghana City? Yes. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're yeah, welcome. <laughs> nice meeting you. You too, you too, uh, you too. All right, so thank you so much for watching. I just wanted to do that quick video, share some of this work with you while I'm here at the Wola Fest. The Wola Fest is a festival of art, music, culture, and um, it's been happening all afternoon. Unfortunately, I got here late because I was at a funeral earlier today, so I just got here and then the sun started setting. And in Ghana, when the sun sets, it sets fast. So um, there's gonna be a concert here afterwards, but I'm probably not gonna be here much longer because I have to also go to the Glitz Fashion Week 
and go and capture some of that and see um, you know the fashion designers that are showing um, their work over there so for now um, I'm gonna sign off and say thank you for watching and um, I'll see you next time take care bye